Well, hello everybody. Laguna back here for some more The Last of Us. We're taking a sidestep through the story. I was told that this is a good time. No, I I know how to play the game. Um, to, to do at least the side story where with the Left Behind DLC, because apparently it takes place in between winter and... Not winter. It, it takes place at the beginning of winter, basically. Now, I'm literally just going to power through this on easy mode today. I can finick and finagle with this all I want to, but I choose to just, you know. <laughs> anyway, we're going to do this as new game data. Here we go. Starting with The Last of Us, The Left Behind. We'll see how this works. I actually don't know how easy easy mode is. I started on normal, and then I went through the grounded mode run. What? Um... Fireflies? Get down! Oh. What the we'll fuck see. are these guys? Stay the cool. fuck back! Joel! <laughs> Put your armor on me! Yeah, we've been at this turn already in the game. We know that he got impaled. Uh, we know everything that's gone on at this point. I think we're safe. Now, some people told me to wait till the game ends before I do this. Other people told me to play it right after Joel gets impaled. So I'm going to take the normal road and I'll do it when Joel gets impaled. Normal, chronologically. Come on. Naughty Dog Entertainment. I will say one thing about Naughty Dog, though. They are really, really good at... It, it, it's a cinematic feel to the game, but it doesn't feel like you're playing an interactive movie, like Heavy Rain. Naughty Dog does it really well. Yeah! <laughs> Riley? Ow! I landed on my hip. What the hell? So bit. Okay, well you were bitten by Riley, so. That was kind of awesome. There's that. You're not gonna kill me, are you? No. I haven't seen you. I like the background post. Too, like know Lizard how Girl. Forty-five uh, days. Postcards, things like that. Well, forty-six technically. Want to know what I've been up to? All this time, I thought you were dead. Well, she's not. Yeah. Here. Look. Well, I'm assuming she's a firefly now. No way. I wonder if she's Marlene's Still daughter. No and I'm not saying that because they share the same traits. Years, and you know how bad that girl smelled. Okay, maybe I am. You're a firefly. But more so, why Marlene took Ellie in, in the first place. <laughs> I can't help but wonder, like, is it something to do with this story? You still have it up. What? There's a lot of theories that I have in doing? my head. I just don't know where those theories are going to lie. I'm making sure I don't get caught with a firefly in my room. Relax. There are no soldiers on the entire floor. Cool. No soldiers on the floor. That's good to know. Here. Congrats. Hey. Are we cool? <laughs> are we cool? We cool? Are we cool? You know? I disappeared and you're mad. And I owe you an explanation. Let's get out of here and I'll tell you all about it. Okay, well... It's almost morning. And I have military drills. You know, where we learn how to kill fireflies. Yeah. Put some pants on and let's go. I kind of actually just realized. <sighs> I'm so dumb. If Ellie had made it to the <laughs> fireflies then in the first place. Then have we ever place. gotten into trouble? Then the entire last of us would never happen. Come on, give me something. Kind of like Indiana Jones. Ah! You take Indiana Jones out of the plot, oh, yeah. and everything would have happened as per normal. Indy didn't actually do anything okay. helpful. I'll put you on your side. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Jesus. Oh. Huh. I like the effects that they have in this game, though. Like the blood that's just running out of his stomach right now is. Surprisingly well done. Um, I can't wait to tear through this easy mode. After going through on normal, it can't be that bad. 
<sighs> like, easy mode is probably gonna throw all of the ammo, upgrade materials, and everything at me. Like, it cannot be as bad as Survivor and. Time. Find something to stitch Dang. you up, okay? Grounded. Callus, keep an eye on him. I still can't believe they named the horse Callus. I'll be back in a flash. Promise. The Left Behind. Here we go. This sounds like the name of like an emo band back when I was in high school. The Left Behind. I totally got this. Oh yeah, you totally got this. Sure. Alright. Now where the fuck do I go? I know exactly where you go. You go... Scavenging around for items. Okay, maybe I, uh... Overshot my uh, my boundaries on that one. I thought I was gonna have like ammo right off the bat. Do I start with ammo? This isn't a good start. <laughs> it's almost more terrifying to start on easy mode because like grounded mode, it's like I know I need to stealth. And by the way, I beat grounded mode the other day. I actually fucking beat Grounded Mode. It was... It was intense. There's a few parts where I didn't realize that I could actually skip past them entirely when I was playing through on Normal Mode, when I was doing this. Um, Grounded Mode... was not that bad. Even the bloater in the gym, like I had troubles with him on Normal. Grounded Mode... Once I figured out how to kill bloaters, nothing. Easy. Actually, oh, shit. no, um, huh. no monsters out here. It's padlocked. But, I need to get medicine for Joel, so let's go to the pharmacy. That seems like a good first place to go. What do we got? Scour the walls. What's this? What the hell? Did you just swallow the pills and leave the bottle? Pop it like candy. God. Like Tic Tacs. Ah, that's better. Ooh, what's this? Of course. Everything's picked clean. Yes, it is. I kind of wonder as well, like, with all the infected they got... Anything? Well, infected. Anything? Um, how many people survived who are actually doctors? Or do they have to, like, relearn the science all over again? These are some questions I wonder about the Last of Us universe. Weston's flu shots. You know, she's kind of cute in a weird, like, Avril Lavigne alabaster doll way. Um, I'm kidding, I fucking hate dolls. Mannequins, too. If you guys ever want to scare the shit out of me, dolls. Mannequins. Pharmacist. Maybe he's got something on him. Okay. Pharmacist went crazy and attacked me. I hit him pretty hard. He's unconscious. I locked him in the American Princess store next door. Please get him help. Okay, well, I guess I found my combination lock. Um, thing. Code. Thirty-five right, three left, thirty-one, 31 right. right. Yeah, that works. I also find it funny though how the, there are so many of these doors that are rusted to shit and will not open, and yet padlocks. Shit, spores. 
They seem to just never rust. If you're gonna jump out at me, go ahead and fucking do it. Ooh, more stuff. I'm almost worried that I'm going to take more damage than I expect in easy mode. I'm assuming the crazy oh, guy. Yuck. Oh man. Don't come to life. Don't it's come also to weird because like nothing. <sighs> the spores that are in this game, they come from dead bodies. Why would they lock him in there instead of killing him? Oh, oh Jesus. Fuck. Damn it! Right. Key. That scared me. Pharmacy. Let's Pharmacy go. key does nothing. Pharmacist note. What does this say? Flip and read. Think about me while I'm off. I'll be missing you, but not too much. Laura. Okay, there's a clicker right there. Just the one? Cool, just the one. And I, I'm personally the person who likes to carry bricks. Cool. So we go in here. Yeah! Got the med kit. I swear to god, if this was just one fetch no. quest, I'm not gonna be happy. Although where they cut from the past to now and the now to past, it might actually be something oh. that a military not too helicopter. Bad. That's gotta have something. But we'll see how that works. Hang in there, Joel. Yeah, hang in there, Jolene. No. Some sugar. Some cloth. Some nothing. I love picking up some nothing. Oh. Picking up nothing? The best. Anything I can make? No. Uh, I don't trust that. Let's see, we got nothing going on in here. Is there anything else? Oh, there is something over this way. Cool. Explosive and cloth and a bleed. Nothing mu Ooh, actually, wait. Right, I still need alcohol to make a med kit. There's really not much in this game, this DLC. Like, I, st I found one clicker. That's nothing much. That don't impress me much. Um, salon note. Let's read this. Chief Warrant Officer Larry Caulfield died bravely this afternoon. We're flying back to the QZ when our patient turned. It must have been spores because none of us saw the bite. Patient broke through the restraints and fell upon our pilot, Warrant Officer Sean Brendan. Even with the helicopter spinning out of control, Officer Caulfield fought the infected patient, saving our lives. We crashed in a rural Colorado mile. Private Eugene Ellis, Officer Caulfield, and I were the only survivors. In subduing the infected, Officer Caulfield was bitten on the neck. He immediately showed us the bite and accepted his fate. I executed the infection protocol before Caulfield could turn into infected. May he rest in peace. Captain Regan Francis, 4th Infantry Division, Denver QZ. So I'm in Denver, Colorado, I'm guessing.
Okay, so there's not much really going on in here. I might even just go through this entire thing in one sitting. Depending on how quick or not it takes. I just looked into the lights. Ugh. Huh? Alright, where are you bringing me? You got fast there. I'm impressed. Thanks. I just want to speed through for the story. I'm more interested in the base game than the yeah. DLC. In my experience, DLC is so never as good as the people say. Yeah. Mostly it's just a bunch of company shills who are trying to say, oh, this is the best. But yeah, we'll we'll see. That's Trevor. I saw him walking down the street, so I tailed his ass. <laughs> I follow him into this alley, and all these fireflies ambush me. They took me right to their hideout. To Marlene. Were you scared? Okay, so her and Marlene are not related. I thought this time she would actually shoot me. But instead she just says, what took you so long? She was expecting me. And she just made you a firefly? Something like that. That whole almost killing me thing was a test. She wanted to know I was committed. Age, oh. eyes, complexion. I really wish it told me her last name so I could figure Speak out. Speak of if... the devil. Yeah. She asks about you. Really? She says you remind her of your mom. Huh. She'd know more than me. Oh, well, let's check out this first. Come on. What if I don't want to? We're making good time. Says you. Who do you hang out with these days? I don't me. Know. I hang out with me. Someone really. Okay, would you fucking get on the goddamn ledge? You know, and the rest of the guys. How are they doing? Riley, those are your friends. But you talk to them. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> I don't anticipate there being a lot of items in this game at this point. I may have misspoke earlier. Although, what's in here? Have you found the light yet? <laughs> oh, har har. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend your people. Can you say that in a game nowadays? So what? You buy into this whole thing now? All I know is that I'm not a soldier. Your people. People are getting infected all the time. They just do a good job of hiding it. You that sounds like military. Infected? As part of my initiation, they actually made me kill this. <laughs> you know, let's talk about something else. Yeah, sure. Let's talk about how you kill things for a living. Hide. Man. Wait, so this isn't Denver, Colorado. Oh wait, Denver was the uh, the future. This is Boston still. That's what she said. Um Maybe I should join the Fireflies. That was the first thing I asked my mom. She wants you safe at that stupid school. I'm not even supposed to come see you. Why does she care? She's worried I'll get you into trouble. Well, you probably will. You're Whatever. probably going to get me in trouble here. I can get into trouble just fine on my own. <laughs> oh, no. oh, there's a hole over here. There's a hole in the middle of the road. Hey, remember the first time I brought you here? What are we doing here, Riley? I have a surprise for you. What? Uh-huh. Is it a dinosaur? No. Maybe. I'll be your friend again if it's a dinosaur. I'll be your friend again. Yeah, I'm gonna see what's under these stairs. Oh. There's a thing. You still saving up for that vacation? Every penny. You? Nope. Every penny. Hey, what if we end up picking? Uh, hello? Surfing in LA? That's right. Surfing in LA. <laughs> Go 
Come on. Let's keep going. You know, I got them back. Huh. Our water guns? Bullshit. You telling me Corporal Dickhead gave them back to you? Hmm. Of course not. Bad. I had to sneak into his office. Riley, I had them in my hands. <laughs> but your ass got caught. Uh, my ass got caught. <laughs> <laughs> the small things that people had to worry about. I mean, Ellie was kind of surprised that all she had to worry about, or all the people in the past had to worry about was boys, clothes, I can't believe Winston what shoes go with what socks. Yeah. Do you know how it happened? They said he just fell off his horse. Heart attack or something. Man. Well, how many people get to die of natural causes in this world? None that I know of. Technically, exactly. all of them. So, let's see what he left us. Really? Uh, sure, why not? Marlene Jr. What's this? Amazon? No. What? Animation? <laughs> Man, guy used to be handsome. Huh. Bingo. Wonder if people are going to say that about me in about 20 okay. years. Um. Uh, I'm going to reject it. More for me. Cheers, Winston. <laughs> Ooh. That's <laughs> strong. Come on. I don't know if that impacts anything, but I rejected it. What happened to Princess? I assumed after Winston died, they took her. Poor horse. She's probably out there terrified. Now, if they turned her into horse meat, she's probably out there terrified. Not funny, was it? All right, let's, 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 let's just do this. Help me lift this. Sure. But we may as well, right? Oh, it always feels like we're gonna get crushed. You probably are gonna get crushed. I'll go first. There it is. You know what? How about we find another way? Yeah. Sounds good. Yes, it does. No, well, we're gonna pull a Joel and we're gonna boost ourselves. Hey, Riley. You know what? I'll get you up and over. See if you can unlock it from the inside. Good call. We'll see how this goes. Most likely, it's gonna be a disaster. Well, you see anything? I'm more surprised with that car falling that I'm not being Riley? overrun with infected already. All right, what you got? <laughs> you dig this two times today. <laughs> How the hell did we never find this place? Come on, I got the perfect mask for you. Uh, why? Riley, perfect. Check it out. What is that like a wolf man or something? Put it on. Well, so far, this is not providing any plot whatsoever. It's just yeah, filler. Bad ass. Now roar. 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 Ellie, really? Fucking roar. All right, well, let's... Well, already another thing, a conversation thing. I used to have those when I was a kid, by the way. Those fake eyes that no matter which way you turn them, they always point up. I always thought they were kind of cool. And yet, mannequins and dolls creep me out. Eyes are nothing. Oh, Jesus. Fuck off. Um. Hmm. 
Did I miss anything over behind this desk? By chance? No, I did not. Where'd Riley go? Where you at, Riles? Ah, there you are. Oh, well, we may as well try a different mask on, right? Of a cringy DLC. Oh, Jesus. Hi, Riley. Just sneak up behind me, are you? Those masks are even cooler. Oh, are you going to get one down for me? Big bad werewolf. Spooky hey, mummy. Kind of hey. That hockey mask looks nothing like a hockey mask. Spooky mummy. Um, oh, you're already... Um, Count Dracula. How do they get these references? Like... <laughs> Actually... Countess. Countess. Uh, oh, she corrected me too. She corrected her too. Countess like, Wizard of Oz. <laughs> I understand that it's like a little timeless classic <laughs> thing, but how would these references carry on in pop culture with like 90% of the population being dead? Like, these kids are 14, maybe. Which is fine that they are 14 and they're old enough to know that, but. They were born six years after the initial encounter with Joel, losing Sarah. What are you so, <laughs> adorable. Why, thank you, kind pigeon. <laughs> Her mask is a fucking angry bird. Um, what's over here? Ask Skelethier a question and shake for your fortune. Okay, she likes puns. Let's see. Are we gonna die today? No bones about it. Future Nothing. bleak. What a jip. Future is grim. Maybe. Chances are dismal. Seems dreadfully unlikely. Okay, dreadfully unlikely. Ah. Whew, we're relieved. Will I drive a car again? No. Feel it in my bones. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Am I ever gonna get to play a video game? Chances are grim. Your chances. Chances are, are dismal. dismal. Hey, I got one of my puns out, sort of. Um. Am I ever getting boobs or what? I feel it in my bones. I keep thinking of Murray the Talking Skull from Monkey Island, by the way. That's where that whole, I feel it in me bones, came from. It's not supposed to be Mr. Krabs. Or whatever. Are you whatever. a butt face? Are you a butt face? Seems likely. I am dead certain it is true. Well, that settles it then. What else you got? Are ever leaving this stupid quarantine zone? Yes. The answer is in limbo. So, there's a chance. I mean... Will we ever get our water guns back? The spirit nods yet. Well, I can take uh, that as a win. That? Says we're getting our water guns back. Let them go, Ellie. Let them go. Whatever there, Riley. Okay. Yeah, what about it? Yeah, red one's yours, I'll be blue. We throw bricks. Whoever breaks all the windows for their car, wins. Are you kidding me? I'm like the brick master. <laughs> all right. Loser has to answer a question. No sarcasm. <laughs> what is this, truth or truth? All right, fool, you're on. Whoa. Yeah, you like that? Boo, I got one. Yes! <sighs> Boo! Two down! And that's how you do it. 
Yeah. Oh, right. <sighs> Giant filler mini games. That's what this DLC is going to be, isn't it? Well, see, Riley's not even close. Last one. Yes. Cool. Fucking master. My car had tough. These kids swear yeah, a lot more than I did when I was a teenager. All right, question time. Okay. I'm scared. Let's see. Um. Why did you leave? How about that one? Um, okay. Why did you leave without telling me? I was in a weird space. Look, I didn't tell anyone. But I wasn't just anyone. Was I? Yes, you were. No, it's just... You gotta see this thing, and we're almost there. Come on. You didn't answer my question. Fun. Now where you leading me? That's the real question. What are we doing here? This place is creeping me out. So, you know how we thought they only powered certain areas of the city? Yeah. Yeah. Follow me. Ah, oh, fuck, fine. I want to read the warning note first. Major Banks, this will be my third request in as many weeks for additional patrols in my area. With the Hartford QZ falling apart, the city has been inundated with refugees, many of which are coming through the mall because of the lack of soldiers over here. These people are desperate, and in most cases, they enter the city infected. As you've seen from my reports, I had to neutralize three stage ones just last week. I realize resources are scarce, but if we don't get more security, I'm afraid that this mall will get overrun in a matter of fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuckity fuck, fuck. You're not gonna listen to a word of this. Forever your lackey, Sergeant Winston Asher. Well, the other thing I was left with, like, with a note, but he had, like, there was a body there? Oh. Ooh, what's this? There's nothing. Um. Okay. Turns out, the whole city has power. Okay. They just flip the circuit breakers. All you gotta do is flip it back. There's no way this is gonna work. Oh! <laughs> what did I tell you? <laughs> Wait, so the whole mall is lit up? Let's go find out. This doesn't seem that bad, actually. You ready to see this? Wait, I. Oh, I'm ready to I see know this. I what you're trying to do, and I'm really glad that you're not dead. Thank you. Sort of. I mean, I'm glad that we're back together, and I didn't mean it. All that stuff I said before I left. I didn't mean any of it. Cool. I don't know what you said, because you didn't flash back to it, but... You're such a sap. Bet you started Oh, man. Are you ready? Totally. <laughs> Are you kidding? And of course, they're going to cut away from it now. So this isn't too bad so far. Well, first things first, we got to explore around. Definitely use some chocolate. Ooh. A 
Atrium note. While supplies are running low, Private Eugene Ellis and I entered the loading dock in hopes of procuring additional rations. Ooh, we were caught off guard and roughly a half a dozen Stage 2s attacked us. We neutralized the threat, but not before Ellis was bitten. After a heated debate where Private Ellis tried taking his own life, I incapacitated him. I then took it upon myself to break protocol. I isolated the infection with a tourniquet. I gathered and cleaned a surgical saw from the abandoned triage. I injected Ellis with morphine before amputating his arm several inches above the bite. I'm confident that once the private regains consciousness, he'll be clear of the cordyceps infection. Interesting. I honestly just want bullets at this point. Just something. Anything. Even a melee weapon. Ooh, bullets. Oh, thank Jesus. I mean, Jesus is... Yeah, I'm not going to get into any religious thing. Some bricks. Fun. Okay, so I can't get in there. Follow the cable. Still gotta check this corner out, though. Whoa! Honestly, this just feels like one giant fetch quest. I've already had to get two med kits. One of them was from the, um... I can do this. Pharmacy. And then one from the dead body. And both of them are empty. Ooh, more bullets. Okay, yeah, this is definitely going to be easy mode. Ooh! Okay, horror movie tropes need to stop. This is not... kosher. Estefria. Jesus fucking Christ, cat. Are you trying to kill me? Oh, man. More bullets. This game loves me. I just heard a couple of thump thump. Boom, boom. There it Here is. Here we go. End of the line. Not yet. I can't tell if that's from the game or not, but there's this, like whirring sound that I'm hearing, and it's like. Like a plane flying overhead. That's a really creepy sound to hear when you're in the middle of a horror game, I'm not gonna lie. This game loves me! Look at all these ammo! Jesus! God, I'm gonna be ready for anything. Even more? I'm full on ammo. Holy fuck, this is gonna be easy. Alright, what we got? Alice has taken a turn for the worse. He's burning up and couldn't keep his food down. Maybe I made a mistake. Maybe the amputation was too late. Maybe when I'm not watching, he'll turn in the infection protocol. We did what we had to for Officer Caulfield. Who the hell am I kidding? We murdered Larry. Ellis held him down while I shot him like a fucking dog. I can't get his screams out of my head. Reagan, please, I still have time. 
Don't do this. Tell us what have we done? I don't like the music. Damn it. <sighs> Empty. Maybe I can find some. Now, statistically, it's likely that one of these big-ass tankers is going to have the, the oil. Okay, we can do this. This is a hell of a lot easier. Man. Okay, obviously I ran out of bullets. You get up there. There you are. Would you get up here? That wasn't so bad. Sounds like it. Okay. Find some gas. Big gas tanker. Statistically likely to have ah, gas. Jackpot. Right, how you do And this? I was right. Take the hose and Yes, suck on it. it. That out. came out really wrong. Oh. Uh, I love the smell of gasoline, not the taste. Actually, I don't like the thought of the taste of gasoline, I should say.
That makes sense, right? The thought of the taste of gasoline. Come on. The concept of gas in my mouth just makes me. It makes me think of like because of the tangy smell. It makes me think of like house keys. Maybe I'm just crazy. Shazam. Bazinga. Quabaha. I don't even know what that word was. Oh Jesus. Ooh. Okay, that was bright. Don't touch electric water. Got it. Aw, but touch electric water would be fun. Also, by the way, I don't know why I need a power to pull that one fucking thing open. I saw an explosive over here. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's, it's a latch. Just, you know? Unless procedurally, like, it powers the pin that locks it or takes... I don't know. gonna be fine. I did see some stuff over here. Into that water and try to yes, you are. <laughs> so it should be fine from here on. I don't even have a separate gun. Or, yeah, gun. If I had a bow, I would be fine. Because at least with a bow, I can be silent. That That's what I'm really hoping for. Hey! How are you? Just in case of bloater. You know bloaters. Obviously they're going to not be ideal to, to deal with. I already know the puzzle on this one. As soon as you give me a door that you'll have to climb onto. You know you got to wedge it open or something. And this is just an obvious puzzle. See? Because I know the weight of a human is not going to hold that door. Blood that I caused. Candy bar. Yeah, I hear you. Is that a Molotov just sitting there on the ground? Okay, so there's a clicker over there. Let's come back for that. So clickers have to rely on a sense of sound. That means that I should be able to get this clicker without that clicker seeing me. It's that guy with his back turned that I'm worried about, though. If he turns his head, you know I'm fucked. And not in the fun way.
we're at least getting through this. And that's that's the main takeaway that I have from this game. Just make it through. Sometimes, sometimes, the game gets just a little bit easier to handle. Um, I am playing through on easy mode, so if I die, it's only going to be at the hands of a clicker, probably. Ideally. Like, I don't expect myself to die in this. Maybe a bloater. A bloater might be doing it. Depends if I can get a shotgun or not. Birds, cats, dogs. And they don't have rabbits, or hamsters, or small rodents. Wait, they do have reptiles. It's over there on the far shelf. Yes. Oh, they do have rodents. Okay, there's mice. In the headphones, by the way. No matter how far away that guy is. It always sounds like he's next to me. There we go. That's that. That is as they say that. Pick up the blade, pick up the blade. Here we are again. Yes. Question. I don't even know where they're coming from. Wait, what? Okay. That could have gone better. I probably should have tried some sneak attacks on that one, honestly. I... You know what? I really didn't care. I'm on easy mode. I'm getting bullets left, right, and center. All right, helicopter. Let's do this. Cool. Before I go to the helicopter, uh, I'll go the opposite way. Cool. That was just a random ass. Oh, there it is. A tree recorder. Um, I don't care to listen to voice notes at this point. Oh fuck. Okay, be cool. Here we go. We now if this med kit is empty, we're pissed. Please be in here, please be in here. 
Nice. Okay. I'm not letting you go. <laughs> I'm not letting you it's go. It's a med kit, Ellie. Calm down. Okay. You ready? Okay, this isn't so bad. I expected this to be a little bit more boring. So, hooray, it's not as boring as I thought it would be. Mint. Um, so far, all I got, though, was Ellie needs medkit. 